Ramen Raider coming at you with another episode of Instant Noodle Recipe Time, the show where I show you what to do with your noodles all the time, this year, next year, every year. So how's 2024? I think you're in 2024. Um, we're going to have some uh, quick, sir, quick cooking uh, shrimp flavor macaroni soup uh, by Nor or Kanor. Yeah. I had a teacher. This name was Mr. Kanor. But it was probably Mr. Nor. Yeah, three minutes. And then you got then you got macaroni. Alright. It's hot weathery outside yesterday it got up to it said 96 but at least 94 I saw that on the gauge in the spot went and walked 10 miles being an alpha liberal and uh, that was fun yeah. oh crap I need fish ball what am I gonna do I guess I'll just drop in some fish ball willy-nilly right now. Yeah. You know folks, when I get fish ball, I get dodo fish ball. But there are other brands of fish ball, just so you know. But I always get the dodo. It's from Singapore. And it's dodo delicious. Yeah? I don't know. It's good. They're good. Packed full of fishiness. Well, some kind of fish that was ground up, made into a, like a slurry, and then uh, formed into little bowls. Today. I already went to the store with my daughter to get stuff for the last review. And yeah. Excuse me. Hope you had a good New Year's Eve, New Year's Day. Unless this episode's on New Year's Eve, and then I apologize. We're gonna have a horrible New Year's Eve. Don't stay at home. Get outside. Hit stop. Go outside. Do something weird. I don't know, drink a bunch, cover yourself in mayonnaise naked and run down the street. What's the worst that could happen? Uh, well, I guess there are some pretty bad things that could be a result of that. Trip and fall, trip and fall. If it's icy, you're not wearing any clothes, covered in mayonnaise, ooh. Um, yeah. Eh, never mind. Why don't you start the, the year off right, you know. Make a sandwich. Have some noodles. Have a noodle sandwich. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. You could do plenty of things, but... Hey! That's obnoxious. <laughs> Girls Gone Wild Mardi Gras edition. Hey! So weird. I'll, I'll admit that. I used to have like tons of fools over and we'd hang out. So I was like, I'm going to get that. You can all watch the Girls Gone Wild Mardi Gras edition. After like five minutes of seeing the flashing, it, it just kind of is like... Uh-huh. Okay. Uh-huh. Just a bunch of drunk people having fun. We're just sitting there bored. It's like, I feel like I'm missing out. Okay, we've had three minutes of boiling these. That's what our, I mean, it's macaroni. I'm gonna 
say, unless they really like chewy macaroni that's not completely done. That ain't completely done. They might like that in Hong Kong. Okay, now we'll try it again. Oh, same kind of thing. It'll continue to hydrate, so if you get this stuff, you're like, it's not done. Just let it sit. It'll get done. But, as it stands, ready to eat, it's not ready to eat. So that knocks some points off. I'm sorry. I have to be honest. But, really, it's not that horrible of a thing. I could knock off a ton of points. I could give it zero stars. I wouldn't though. The broth's kind of. Yeah, I'll show you. It's our broth. As you can see it's not very colorful or thick. It does taste like shrimp ish, kind of. out of my mega shrimp the only place to get that is on Amazon and it used to be if you had prime uh, it was like free to do fresh around here now you don't have to pay for shipping or delivery fees if you order 150 bucks worth of stuff off of fresh just like, eh, 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 eh. kind of makes the machine quiver a little. They've got stuff you can't get anywhere else, like my wife's gluten-free pizza dough. She freaking loves that stuff. But you can't buy it anywhere. They only sell it through Amazon Fresh. Need to get her more of that. It makes her so damn happy. We have to get her more of that. Folks, we have to get her more of that. Crushed red pepper. I mean the pizza dough, not crushed red pepper. That is not her jam. I eat enough spicy junk for everybody in the house, I guess. That's funny. But yeah, it's not ramen, but it's something you would find on the instant noodle aisle at your local Asian grocer. So if you ever wondered about it, this is how it comes out. It's not bad, and if you treat it like, I mean, I've seen tonkatsu uh, macaroni before. In fact, there is a chain in Malaysia called Old Town White Coffee. I guess the closest thing I can compare it to is like Denny's, but it's different. But uh, they had a deal with Mike. There. They had a deal with Mike Kowali. And you could get macaroni, white curry macaroni, with all the dressing up and everything. Pretty, pretty snazzy. Didn't get to try that there, but pretty cool. Jack noodle and from 
when I'm getting out of it, you don't have to cook it. Yeah, you just put in the sauce, you put in the noodles, stir it up, and you're done. So, if I'm wrong about that, I'll be doing this again. <laughs> but that's what I got out of it. So, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. This has been Hans Ramenator wishing you enjoyment of your noodles each and every day. Like and subscribe helps like minded people find more information about instant noodles. Hey, have a good one. Bye bye.